stop chasing your specific person, do this instead and watch what happens next. Namaste my friends, welcome back to another video. My name is Matt, I'd like to thank you for stopping by to manifest with me today. In this video, I wanna share with you what you need to do instead of chasing your specific person, right? And this is very, very easy to do. It's very easy when we're trying to manifest someone specific, when we're trying to bring someone into our lives for love, it's very easy for us to think we need to go out and take a bunch of action on the outside. It's very easy for us to think we need to go up to our specific person and say, hey, 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 look at me, pay attention to me, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here, and chase them down. But we can't do that because the more we chase, the more we repel that specific person away, the more desperate we are, the more we're in this vibe and this alignment of lacking and we'll never get what we want when we're focused on lack. We'll continue to get more lack. So that, there's actually something else that we can do instead that's actually pretty simple to be completely honest with you, pretty simple. And if you just focus on this new thing for just a little bit of time, it's gonna completely change everything and you'll be surprised at what happens next. Your specific person is gonna start chasing you. So we're gonna to get to that in this video. Before we do though, enrollment is happening right now for the 21 day manifesting a specific person challenge. If you have a specific person that you wanna manifest in your life within the next 21 days, I'm gonna give you the most powerful techniques in order to do so spanning across the next 21 days we'll be together. If you're interested in enrolling, spots are very limited at this time. So there is a link in the top of the description box below. Click that, sign up, and I will see you in there. Okay, so to get this started, we need to remember, in order to manifest what we want, we need to be in the state of the wish fulfilled. That's what Neville Goddard tells us. So we need to be in the end state. We need to be in this feeling state of, I'm with my specific person. It's already done, it's finished, it's complete. There's nothing else I need to do. If we can feel those feelings, if we can generate those feelings, our specific person will come, right? But we're not generating those feelings. Usually we're chasing. So again, we're feeling desperate, we're feeling lack, we're feeling like we don't have that person and thus we are creating the reality. That's our wish fulfilled, that's our end state. We don't have them, so we're creating a reality where we don't have them, where we're constantly chasing them. So there's something very, very important that we need to do instead. We need to stop chasing. We need to realize that the action we take on the outside does us no good and actually repels our specific person further away. And actually the important thing is to go inside of ourselves and start focusing on something different. And to reveal what we need to uh, focus on inside, I'm gonna share with you a quote from Neville Goddard. Check this out. Living in the state of the wish fulfilled means simply that you must accept the fact that the desire is fulfilled. Feeling grateful, fulfilled, or thankful, it is easy to say thank you, isn't it wonderful, or it is finished. When you get into the state of gratitude or thankfulness, you are feeling the wish fulfilled, and the things you want must come to be. Okay, so to break this down, what Neville is saying is, if you had your specific person, wouldn't you feel pretty grateful? Wouldn't you feel pretty thankful? Wouldn't you feel pretty happy? And so if you start feeling those now and putting your focus on attention on those feelings and emotions now, you will manifest your specific person without chasing them at all. They will come into your life. So again, switch your focus from the outside and put your focus on the inside. Put your focus on feeling grateful. Put your focus on feeling thankful. Put your focus on feeling as happy as possible. Just by doing that, you're gonna be in the state of the wish fulfilled and you're gonna manifest everything you want, more than just your specific person. The, the, the money you desire, the, the success you desire, whatever it is, that, that will come into your life as well because you are in the state of the wish fulfilled. So turn your focus to gratitude. Turn your focus and, and look around your room right now and find 10 things that you can be grateful for. It could be anything, it could be your pet, it could be uh, your computer, it could be your television, it could be the house or, or, the, or the apartment or wherever that, that you're inside right now, it could be the whole thing. Say thank you for those things, just for the sake of saying thank you. Look at those things and say, man, isn't it wonderful? Aren't I blessed that I have these things that I love so much in my life? When you do this, you start raising your vibration, you start changing your alignment, you start changing your focus, 
And again, you're in that perfect alignment and end state to getting your specific person. We're no longer chasing, so we're no longer feeling needy and feeling desperate. We're feeling very grateful for the things that we already have in our life. Again, isn't it wonderful? This wonderful life I have right here in front of me that I get to live. I guarantee you, even if you don't think your life is wonderful, even if you look around and say, oh, it's not, I guarantee you, your life is wonderful. No matter what is happening in your life right now, no matter what your life looks like, I guarantee you there is someone out there that, that would kill to have your life, that would, that would do anything to have your life. Really, really, truly. We sometimes don't know how good we have it. And I promise you, you have it pretty good because there's always someone out there that would want what you have. So take the time and be grateful for that. Take the time and say, thank you. Take the time and feel happy. Do things that make you feel good, okay? When your mind switches off from chasing your specific person and into this state of just happiness, of gratitude, of love, of thankfulness, you are now in the state of the wish fulfilled. You are now in the end state. You've achieved the end state without even looking for your specific person, without going out and chasing them, without doing anything. You're in that state of the wish fulfilled. And once you do that, watch what happens next. Your specific person will come to you. It's not gonna take long either. Don't think this has to be a year long project. Do this for a couple weeks. Feel your life change. Feel the difference. See your life change. Watch as your specific person comes chasing you. Now, what if you wanna manifest a phone call from your specific person? What if you want more instant results? I'm gonna share with you a very powerful technique that will allow you to obtain a phone call from your specific person faster than you can imagine. I'm gonna share that with you in this video right here, so be sure to check it out next.